Friends, if you go to give an interview, then a question will be asked to you there that 1000 kVA generator which is there or the 500 kVA generator which is used, how much load can we connect to these generator? So at the moment, suppose we have a 1000 kVA generator. Now here we have to find out how much load we can connect to the generator. So to find out the answer, we simply have to use this formula. That is, we have to multiply the kilovolt ampere value with the power factor. If we multiply this, we will get the answer. We have a 1000 kVA generator, so we will write 1000 instead of kVA. If you know the power factor, then write the power factor. If you don't know the power factor, then simply use 0 0.8 there. So if we multiply 1000 by 0 0.8, then the answer will be 800. Now this answer of 800 kVA is according to our 100% load. Now here you have to understand one thing that we always connect 80% load to our generator. Now if you want to know that to the 1000 kV generator, if you want to connect only 80% load to this generator, then what will be the answer? So for this simply multiply 1000 by 0.8. After multiplying this, you will get the 100% load. Now we have to find 80% of the 100% load. That means we have to calculate 80% of 800 kilowatt. So for this we simply multiply 800 by 80 and then divide it by 100. After doing this much work, we will get the answer as 640 kilowatt. That means the maximum load we can connect to the 1000 kVA generator is 640 kilowatt. If we connect this much load and run the generator, then there will be no problem in the generator. If you were asked in the interview that how much load you can connect on your generator, then you have to tell the 80% load value here. Now if you have ever worked on a generator, then you must have noticed that logbook we use where we write the entire data of the generator. In that logbook, we always write the ampere rating. We also write the kilowatt rating, but mostly we look at the ampere that how much ampere load is running on our generator. Friends, before moving forward, let me tell you something. If you are an electrician or an electrical engineer looking for the best book to level up your skills, then I have got something perfect for you. This electrician A to Z wiring book written by Arun Gupta, this book contains 100 plus circuit diagrams with 190 pages including DOL starter, star delta starter, reverse forward starter and many other essential working diagrams that every professional must know. The best part is you can get this book instantly as a PDF. Just visit to www.wiringschool.com or click the link in the video description to buy the book. Once you make the payment, you will get an option to download the book right away. And we will also send the download link directly to your email for easy access. This is not just a book. It's your ultimate guide for mastering electrical wiring. Don't miss out. Grab your copy now. Okay, let's continue to our video. In the interview, it may also happen that you were asked this question that how much ampere load can you connect to the 1000 kVA generator? So if you want to find out the ampere rating of any generator, then first of all, you have to find out the kilowatt. After finding out the kilowatt, you can convert it to ampere there. Now, according to calculation we have done, if we connect 100% load, then it will be 800 kilowatt. And if we want to connect 80% load on the generator, then it will be 640 kilowatt. So here which ampere value we have to find out, according to that you can do the calculation here. For the time being, I will tell you how much ampere current can be flowed on the 80% load. So to find out this, this formula is power equal to root 3 into voltage into current into power factor. Now instead of power here, you can write the power of the 100% load or you can write the rating of the 100% load. That means you can write 800 kilowatt here or you can write 640 kilowatt which is 80% of the load. For the time being, let's use 80% load. So here we will write 640. Now the value of root 3 is 1.732. Apart from this, we have to write the rating of the voltage. Normally if our generator is of 3 phase, then we get a power supply of 415 volts and 420 volts there. If you do the calculation, then you should use 415 there. Apart from this, we have to find out the current. And I told you that we have to use 0.8 power factor if we don't know the power factor. Now, if we multiply the root 3 voltage and power factor here, then the answer will be 572.02. Now we have to divide this answer by kilowatt. That means if we divide 640 by 575, then the answer will be 1.11. Now, this answer is our ampere rating, but this answer is in kilo ampere. Now, if you want to convert this kilo ampere into ampere, then simply multiply it by 1000. After multiplying, the answer will be 1110 ampere. That means if we want to flow maximum ampere current on the 1000 kVA generator, then we can flow 1110 ampere current in that condition. 
So friends, I told you how to convert KVA into kilowatt and how much kilowatt load can be connected to our generator or how much ampere load we can connect on generator. How to find this, I told you this also. Now, if you use this formula, then it will take a lot of time to find out the answer. So if you want to find out the answer in a simple way, that is, if you want to give the answer in 10 seconds in the interview, then simply use the short trick. Let's understand the short trick. The first trick is that if we want to convert KVA into kilowatt, then simply multiply KVA by 0.8. You will get the answer. So this was to convert KVA into kilowatt. Now, if you were asked how much maximum load you can run, then multiply KVA by 0.64. If you directly multiply 1000 KVA by 0.64, the answer will be 640 kilowatt. This means 1000 kV generator which is there, you can connect a maximum load of 640 kilowatt to that generator. As you can see here, I told you a simple calculation. If you were asked what is the maximum load of the 500 kV generator, then simply multiply 500 by 0.64. You will get your answer. Now, if you want to tell the current rating here, I mean if we connect 100% load to the generator, then what will be the current flow in that condition? For this, simply convert KVA into kilowatt. I have already told you how to convert KVA into kilowatt. So simply multiply that kilowatt value by 1.732. If you multiply value by 1.732, then you will get the answer as 1385 ampere. That means the current flow will be 1385 ampere if we connect the full load to the 1000 KVA generator. Apart from this, if you want to tell the current rating of 80% load, that means the maximum load that we can connect so that there is no effect on the generator. Then to 80% load, as I told you, if 1000 kVA generator is there, then we multiply it by 0.64. Answer which will come after multiplying this, we have to multiply that answer with 1.732 in the same way. This means if we multiply kilowatt by 1.732, then the answer will come as 1108 ampere. Now this ampere rating is perfect ampere rating which can flow the maximum current on the 1000 kVA generator. So to find out the answer, I have given you the short trick. Thanks for watching this video.